Welcome, welcome everybody to another awesome episode, everybody, of Pixelmon Island. That's right, everyone. We are back with yet another episode, yet another fun day, where we are going to be training, getting ready for that big tournament coming up on, I believe it was October 2nd. So we got just about half a month left to get our training in. But for those of you who don't know what that's all about, welcome! To my server, Pokeplay.io. So, if you guys want to join in, it's in the fourth line of the description. That's where you can go ahead and join on in, hang out with us, and have fun. Um, it's also how you download like, the mod pack and all that stuff. Uh, and right now, we are on the OP server. So, the way we are doing this tournament is simple. Whoever can come up to be the top 30 people on the leaderboards. So, let's go type this in. Leaderboards right here. We'll get to face off against myself, Cappy, and, well, the other 30 contenders out there uh, in a tournament style bracket on October 2nd. So it's basically the first ever Pixelmon Island that we're doing on this channel where you guys, the viewers, are able to participate, provided you have a working version of Minecraft Java Edition. That's literally the only requirement. It's free to join after that point. Um, so, apart from that, everyone, hopefully we get some good old training in today, and also just some good old hanging out with you guys. Happy Friday. Hope you're all having a fantastic start to your weekend. And hopefully this only makes it better, you know what I'm saying? So... Uh, I do know. Hey, there's Cappy and Selena as well. So thank you again to PokePlay.io for sponsoring this live stream. And let's get on to it. Cap, you ready for fun? Yeah. I mean, yeah, totally, bro. I'm so yeah. good at fun. <laughs> You're not nearly as good as I am at fun. Oh, man. Fun. Watch. I'm going to fun like... Uh, fun. Did you just fun? Dude, I funded. I funded everything. F is... For friends that do stuff together. together. F is for fire. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what do I want to train today? Well, I, I mean, if I get any rare candies, that's going to get dumped right on my Caesar. That's the obviously the powerhouse of the team. But everything else, I'm going to do most of my training with Lucario and Smalamance and Charmizard. I think that might be a good what? idea. Inventory so first things first to get us started bro. off we need to get some XP multipliers going and the best way to do that is to beat some of these gyms um, yeah yeet, son. now my team isn't as good as it was you know in the last series that I did so because of that I might struggle a tiny bit on beating uh, the rock gym leader but we'll see we'll see I was thinking about this the other day guys I am dreading right now going back to uh, indigo league simply because if i'm deleting all my pokemon again whoa entei spawned the extreme hills biome but if, what? I, if i'm deleting and uh, all my pokemon again uh you know just to make it like more fun and challenging that mm -hmm. means that i need to face off against levels 200 to 300s with brand new pokemon you realize how challenging that's going to be that ain't easy being that cheesy you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. if, if it was easy, everyone would be that cheesy. Exactly. But it ain't that easy. Exactly. Because there's only one Cheddar Cheetah. The who? That's what his name is. Cheddar Cheetah. Oh, I want to meet this Cheddar Cheetah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know who's, like, really awesome? Who's that? You? Matt, Matt, well, well Matt, I was going to say Mattress <laughs> Mac. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh my oh my <laughs> make me blush no <laughs> anyway uh i was gonna say mattress mac the man's insane i love him <laughs> like i shook that man's hand whenever i went in the fox news and then i sat down in a room across like 50 feet away thought he was on tv but no he was just yelling that loud <laughs> he's just always that loud <laughs> Like, I hear him doing his pitch, like, I am Mattress Man. So, Selena, I can do two toxic spikes. How many regular spikes? Three. Wow. I got everything down before my Fortress died. But I'm also on my last Pokemon here, so wish me luck here. Yes, way to go. And, oh, my. That did not as much damage as I was hoping it would. Oh, but it was enough. Your boy beat the gym on his last Pokemon. <laughs> Now I have a 1.5 times multiplier. Well, that was underwhelming. But still, it's something. It'll help us out. All right, let's go to spawn. Uh, burr, 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 burr. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I'm going to beat a gym today. I hope. 
Okay, Good so let's yeah. see. Which gym you going for? Well, I can always beat the grass gym, so I don't want to beat that one today, you know? Yeah. It's like, I want to try something new and exciting. Let's go to the steel gym. I don't think I've ever beaten the steel gym. That's the, la the last final gym. Yeah, but if you beat it, you get like all the old multipliers. Oh, yeah, don't get me wrong. I think it's great. For me, the hardest gym to beat was the ice gym. That was the one I struggled Ooh. with the most out of any. Oh, it's got some tricky customers in that one, dude. Dude, I, I was not prepared. Because the ice gym also had a lot of, like, multi-type Pokemon that really caught me off guard. Like a good old, I think we had a really high-leveled Weevil. And which is like a dark type ice, mm -hmm. I think. And I don't know. Dark ice. Yeah. It's super OP. And then that, uh, I think it's Mega Obama Snow. Mega Obama Snow. Yes, they did have that. You're right. And that one's grass ice. Yeah, which is weird. Like, I'm pretty sure that's four times, I mean, like, that's four times weak to fire, but I'm not sure how well that tracks with Obama Snow. Hello, yeah. Monica. <laughs> Hey, I got some rare candies. Let's go. All right, let's go drop these on Caesar. Of course, uh, usually going into Mega Evolution, like, it, uh, whatchamacallit, it changes your types a lot of the time, so I don't know what Mega Obama Snow is. Uh, it's just the same heart. ice grass. Oh, he's a chump. I need to clear out my inventory here. Why do I have something in my inventory called the All, the all Holy Apple? Uh, it, it, uh, uh, it's an apple. Are you sure? Double check. Taste it. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> like chicken. What yep. You... That's definitely chicken. <laughs> Why, is the... Why is it chicken? Why wouldn't an apple taste like chicken? Selena, have you never had an apple before? Is this another one of those things <laughs> that you've never had? No, I've 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 had an apple. I I can assure you. Kathy, that. I don't think she's ever had an oh, apple. Oh no, before. she's Clearly never not. had an apple. Clearly not. <laughs> Dude, getting these levels right okay. now is just not easy. I bet. Is bug? Huh. Aaron sent out stack. Okay, so now, what is Stack Attack, by the way? Is that an Ultra Beast or what? Yes. Yeah, Stack Attack, yeah. Dude, that thing looks cool. And that's a Steel type? Um, I don't know. I think he's a ghost. Well, he's in the Steel Gym, so I'm wondering, you know? Maybe he's a ghost Steel, or maybe I'm just entirely wrong. Maybe. Stack attack. Stack attack is the 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 rock steel. Rock thing. steel. Why did I think he was ghost? Kind of looks spooky. Yeah, he do. I guess so. Spooky. Yeah. All right. Okay. Here we go. And remember, guys, hop Great. online if you want to come play with us. Um. You know, we've got plenty of room on the server, and you can come compete in the tournament. To give you an idea of how easy it is to get yourself onto the leaderboard, right now, in order to, to get on the thing, once again, you need to be in the top 30 players. Now, this right here is for... I don't know why it says rank 25 for that. It, he should be rank 28. But in order to get to rank 28, you need to get 53 points. Now, you get 3 points per win, 1 point per loss. So, in about 20-ish battles of wins you could get yourself on that leaderboard. And there's literally no limit to the amount of times you can um, you can do it. So it's pretty cool. And, oh, someone give me a rare candy cap. Let's go. Use it on Caesar. Nice. Simon nice. Frazier, thank you for the $7 stream tip. He said he didn't get a notification. Ah, uh, yeah, I, I kind of figured as much. When I look at the... Whenever I see the view count is and it's below, like, you know, 500 before we, like, when we start off a stream, and I pretty much all but guarantee that, you know, those YouTube notifications, they keep them close to their heart. <laughs> Dang, I lost against the Steel Gym Leader. Dude, it's a rough one. You shouldn't... Don't don't beat up on yourself. Oh, no worries. I'll beat up back, on the leader. creators of it. Selena? Yeah. <laughs> what Selena? Is this? Oh, what is this oh, garbage? Oh, oh. Everybody knows the YouTuber wins. I mean, what? I mean... He ain't what? Wrong. <laughs> he ain't wrong. 
All right, so we're going to do some off-screen training. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> oh, there we go. Look at those levels for Salamance there. That's nice. And Selena, so have we decided a hard number? Because I think we promised in, a, in this stream we would have a number for them that would be what was the max level Pokemon that would be allowed in the tournaments. What do you think? Uh, probably 3,000. 3,000. thought about all right, so there it is, everyone. It's been decided. Selena clearly thought long and hard about this, as you could tell by the uh, stammer. Yeah. She made a yeah. really rough and hard decision, but she's very firm on it, as you could tell by the, um, I guess. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So 3,000 <laughs> is going to be the top level for the tournament. So get your Pokemon to level 3,000. Uh, otherwise, you might be disadvantaged for the tournament. I know coming up to the tournament more and more, I might even do some streaming as well over uh, where I do sometimes on Facebook just to get myself some extra levels and training in here because... Uh, Otherwise, you know, I might not do too hot in the tournament. And we don't want that. We don't want that one bit. Maybe we Okay. Don't. Maybe we want that I'm a little I'm trying the ice gym now. Right. Here we go. No, oh, full corona. Okay. Zap cannon. Dang it. He avoided the attack. Explosion. Dang. Okay. Ah, uh, no way I need gonna get any of these. Simon Fraser, thanks again for a seven dollar stream tip. You're the captain, by the way. He said, uh, it's not just for you, all my notifications I'm not getting. And he doesn't know why because he hit the bell. Now that I don't know about then. I'm not sure. Um But that is sad, buddy. That is really sad. Cause how else are you gonna stay up to date on Jerome ASF, Jerome Ace, Jerome ASF Roblox? You know, how are you gonna stay up to date with all your favorite channels? Yeah, man. Come on. Oh, Mega Steelix, he's just about to destroy me here. Okay, let's see. Bullet Punch. There we go. Okay. Mammoth Swine. Oh, wow. Wait, Caesar doesn't have Levitate? How does Earthquake hit him? Because Caesar huh? is a flying type, yeah? Or a flying steel, no. or is he Bug Steel? No, he's bug, bug Steel. Oh, really? I just always just. Oh, man. I thought he replaced his bugness for steelness. Um, nope. But Simon Fraser, I appreciate you. Thank you for being our captain of the live stream, buddy. You're awesome. I might do some uh, join Q wow. battles in here as well. Get those rolling. A Lapras with Thunderbolt, really? What's wrong with Thunderbolt? <laughs> Like Maga, and Meteor Mesh, power I me through. I forgot he could learn that move. It's a little Dang bit of a it. strange move for it because it's water type. Yeah, it is. It's weird. Okay, bullet punch. What's okay, wrong with cool. Wobbuffet's texture? What do they do to him? <laughs> On my screen, it's a purple and black box. You know, like the no texture missing. Oh, poor I Wobbuffet. Know. I do. <laughs> Okay, outspeed this mega evolution. Blue! Out He's a member! I thought you already were a member. Maybe it just does that every month to like let me know, like, hey, this person's been a member for a month. Either way, thank you, Blue. Shell trap. Nice. Oh, that's some XP going right there. There we go, Lucario's getting some XP. All the good Pokemons are getting XP. I need to get probably like 150 rare candies is probably the fastest way if I want to get my C's order level. 3,000. So that's going to be a little Dang. Thing, but... That Lapras just nuked my entire team. Sounds about right. Now... Jerome, when am I going to get good like you? Dude, I'm... This season, I'm not very good. I... I Last season, I was epic. But right now, Cap, my team's like... Dude, I'm going to barely get over that finish line ready for that tournament, to be completely honest with you. Like, my Pokemon are not cutting it. Like, watch, I'll, I'll even join the Q battle right now, and I bet you I get rolled. Ooh, okay, first challenger is actually someone I could beat. It is nice. 2,161. I can actually beat that Pokemon. So let's see. Bring it on, Guy Fieri. Ha, <laughs> your Pokemon missed. Ha, ha, ha. Uh, ominous wind. Okay, now he got me. All right, Fortress. 
Stay alive, Fortress. Whatever you do, stay alive. Oh, no, he's doing Dragon Dance style stuff. He's doing Dragon Dance stuff. We got to put him down. <laughs> yeah, Dragon Dance can carry you through an entire team, honestly. Actually, he was doing Calm Mind, but same principle applies. <laughs> Night Slash, hit him hard. Caesar, hit him hard. Yeah, there you go. Good man, good man. And I got one shot because I think I had done so many Calm Minds. Oof. Do you have any priority moves? Um, Like no. Bullet Punch, Mock Punch, Aerial Ace. No, I think Aerial Ace just never misses. I don't think I do. Oh, those are like essential whenever I try and run a team. Like, my Metagross always has Bullet Punch. Uh... Your, your Scizor should be able to learn it. That might be a good move for it to learn. Fortress stayed on. Ah, oh, jeez. I'm dead. This Lugia took me out, guys. Hey. Okay, so let, let me see. Slash IV3. Special attack. Slash EV3. Okay. Ah, and GG. Stats. Okay, so it's not bad special attack. Oh, see the next battle I queued up. This guy's got a level 3,900 Mewtwo. Nice. Oh, man, Sturm, I could use some help. If anyone's got some rare candies lying around, they're not using the thing. And then we'll help Baka Rifle out. your pockets. Take Sturm, it all. Are you asking for free stuff? I mean, yeah. if they got extra rare candies, yeah. That's exactly what I'm doing. <laughs> yeah, <man. laughs> precisely I mean, what I'm, I'm doing. So I, mean, I, I, I thought I made that very clear. Okay, I want to see. I'm gonna tell Blade on you. Blade's not here. Huh. Can Magnazone learn Volt Switch? Kaida's gaming Astro. What happens if you mix Blastomos and New Jersey Fried Street Chicken? Dude, the results are horrible. You don't want to know. It's a, it's a disaster, really. You get an all-seeing chicken. Uh, do you like the O's fuse with his eyes? <laughs> Ooh, baby. That's the noise he makes, too. Caps, you've seen him before? Yeah. Ooh, <laughs> baby. Miguel Granillo, thanks for a $5 stream tip. I appreciate you, pal. I said, you ever eat mashed potatoes with a rib bone because you were too lazy to get a spoon? Me neither. That seems <laughs> oddly too specific for you not to have done that. Probably right as we're speaking right now. Are you doing that as we speak, Miguel? Is this is this happening right now? Because <laughs> I really feel like that's happening at this exact moment, Miguel. I'm looking to see. Okay. Dang, I'm. I don't think Magnazone can learn Volt Switch, which is a huge bummer. All right, Charge let me go do a little, try and do a little more training. See if we can sneak one in here. Okay. Let's see. I kind of want to buy Charge Beam then. Charge Beam. What does that one do? I know it's an electric move, but is it good? It's a damage dealing electric type move introduced in Generation 4. It's DM57. Damage is target. The chance to increase special attack. Yeah. Do you think maybe I should go for Thunderbolt instead, Selena? Do you have a different electric move? I have Zap Cannon, but it's not very accurate, you know? Yeah. What's your other moves on it? Uh, so I have Zap Cannon, Magnet Rise, Gyro Ball, and a, um, Explosion. Uh... Oh, uh, maybe... Maybe I just replace my steel type move. I don't know. I'm I'm trying to decide whether it's worth even keeping Zap Cannon. Ooh, like... Ooh Simon Fraser thinks a seven dollar stream tip. Simon, you're the captain, my friend. Still, 
undefeated. He said, Pokemon Sword Online ranked double. No one is playing. Well, I'm trying to get some testing with my team for a tournament. Oh, do you do competitive Pokemon modding? Pokemanny Manny. Pokemanning. Yeah, the, the Manny Man. Manny you know? Man. Yeah, like <gasps> Handy Manny. You know what that reminds me of, Caffy? What? Because <laughs> I'm the Taki Man. Yes, I'm the Taki 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 I'm the Taki Man. Come on, Cookie. She doesn't seem amused. Cookie stream? <laughs> I don't know. Does Cookie want to be on stream? Cookie, do you want to be on stream? Okay, so Flash Cannon. I bought Flash Cannon instead, and I'm going to teach my boy Flash Cannon. Simon so Fraser, sure thanks for the $7 stream tip. He said, yeah. Well, Simon, I think Selena used... To, did you used to do competitive Pokemon, or do you just have a lot of knowledge in that space? Um, I always considered it, but I haven't really gone much farther than Pokemon Shota. <laughs> She's won national tournaments. Uh, totally, yeah. Uh, they, yeah, yeah. Uh, definitely. Totally. Okay. Like world champion over here. Okay, time to go battle a gym. I might go and battle a gym as well. I'm not having any luck with these uh, trainers today. So it's, I still can't believe a Pachirisu made world champion slot. What? Like, like really? Pachirisu is a world champion. <laughs> Ugh, disgusting. Wait, how? <laughs> it just had a lot of uh, utility moves. It had things like uh, follow me so that it could redirect attacks from its allies. And then it had nuzzle to guaranteed paralysis. And... Wait, what does follow me do? Uh, basically, since all competitive is basically in double battle format. Yeah. Uh, any moves that would have targeted your ally would go to the person using follow me. Ah. So you could like redirect attacks from your ally so that your ally doesn't get hurt. And, and is that for had... double battles only? Yeah. Okay. And it had so... like nuzzle to paralysis things, and then it also had super fang, which is basically guaranteed half damage based on the opponent's current health, so... Wait a, a minute. We just got a bunch of stream tips. Thank you. Dog Veed. Thanks no. for the $5 stream tip. Dog Veed said, July 2015, Florida man fires musket at drivers on Seven Mile Bridge. Why does that not surprise oh. me? That's because you were there, Jerome. <laughs> I might... I, I, I might have been... <laughs> And Connor Gorman coming in as the captain of the live stream. Thank you, Connor, for the top stream tip we've had so far. 7.5 pounds, which is about like 10 bucks or so. He said, subscribe recently and got hooked. Keep up the good work. Connor, thank you, my man. I'm glad you're liking the content. We uh, just recorded today. I'll let you know uh, the second rendition of Among Us. Blade and Selena absolutely killed it on the oh, yeah. setting up of the Among Us map. Um, Among Us in Minecraft, that is. Um, and we actually added some new things in it since the last video went up like two days ago very rare that we filmed the same thing within a three-day span um but you guys just loved among us so much in minecraft so connor we got some cool stuff coming your way we also did a, our own in-house uhc where i literally went ahead and paid a uh developer to make custom um mobs for us so we we're, we we've been going ham i'm going bacon yeah yeah, why it's is it bang. ham? What is that saying? Like, we're going... Eh, whatever. Yeah, right. Well, I I don't know if it came from the burger song. You know, the one where it's like, We're going ham! This is how a burger is supposed to be. The fries are blend so perfectly. You Wait, don't remember a that? burger made of ham? It's a hamburger. I guess so. But I was thinking more like traditional style ham, you know? No, that'd be disgusting. I, I could see like a pork patty, you know. What about just like cold cut quality ham? Oh, that would just be a very bad sandwich. <laughs> Ninja Bear, thanks for the ten dollars stream tip. That's about as much as the last stream tip. So I guess you're, you're tied for the cap of the stream. He said, "Good evening, Jerome. I'm very happy today, and my puns aren't vile plume. Do you think they are good? I know all these puns were unexpected." 
Wow. Oh, God. Wow. They were painful, and then you hit me with Onyx, Spected, and I... <laughs> I'm... Oh, Ninja Bear, why? Why'd you have to do it to us, man? He said, formerly... So, sorry, he's like the, the artist formerly known as Prince. His name is Ninja Bear 529 formerly known as Isaac Parker. <laughs> the artist formerly known as Isaac Parker. Well, President Blastum. <laughs> Remember that? Oh my gosh, yeah. Simon Fraser, thanks to the $7 or dollar stream tips. And my team is Dusclops, Politoed, Kingdra, Ferrothorn, Arcanine, and Gigalith. Where's Diglett, dude? Yeah, man. Does that team sound good to you, Selena? Sounds garbage. Yeah. Fox Squad, thanks for a $15 stream tip. He said, hi, Jerome. Hi, Mr. Fox. Thank you so much for uh, for coming out. Appreciate you, pal. I feel like I haven't really kept up with the sword and shield meta just because I don't really like it. I'm not the biggest fan of Dynamax. I appreciate its existence. I just prefer Gen 7 meta over Gen 8. Oh, <laughs> did you hear that they're bringing the Gen 3 legendaries to the sword and shield? Oh, that's cool. Yeah, so imagine like Dynamax Rayquaza. <laughs> that's going to be cool. And I forgot, Fox Squad, I forgot to say thank you for being the captain of the live stream. $15 stream tip. That's the largest one we've got, so thank you so much. You are the captain now. No, I'm going to swing. Ninja Bear, the artist formerly known as Isaac Parker. Prepare yourselves, guys, because he's about to hit us with more puns. Thanks for another $10 stream tip, Ninja Bear or Isaac. He said, yes, indubitably, Jerome. Also, Cappy, how are you? Can you diglet me a hole and jump into? I know my puns are very far-fetched. Jerome, this stream <laughs> is also unexpected. The far-fetched one I actually might use myself on. So I'm gonna steal that. This one kind of makes me want to puke a muku. <laughs> oh, I see. Uh. <laughs> Hitting them back. Simon Fraser thinks a seven dollars stream. Tim said it's a rain team with track room. Some Pokemon got banned this season. Really? Why they get banned? Is it too OP? Yeah, over usage. I feel like. <laughs> If there's Damn a Pokemon that's overused, like, I feel like, I don't know. I don't know why they'd ban it. I feel like at that point, it's just, like, a trainer should come along and learn how to counter it, right? I mean, that yeah, but... that's an advantage to your, to the opponents. Like, if I know 80% of my opponents are going to run this Pokemon, then I'm just going to run a counter. Mm, I mean, he's not wrong, but, like... I'm sure they have their reasons. It's also a case where with the limited Pokedex, in certain cases, there may not be a counter at this current moment. But they do change the ban list pretty frequently, and they have different, like, themes for the ban list. I think right now they just didn't want any legendaries and no overused Pokemon. They wanted to... I don't know. Cappy, it... I, I don't normally say this in a non-joking way, but I mean this in a non-joking way. Did they try mm. getting good? <laughs> That's all I hear. It's a bunch of complaining McComplainersons. Uh, if I find the ban list for right now... Oh, I forgot this Cradley is miserable to deal with because he just uses a bunch of protects and re recovers and... Ooh. I haven't paid too much attention, so I don't even know what series we're on. We on this one? Do, 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 do. Oh, take some of that cradley. Yeah, you're not ready for the Dragon Claw, are you? Dragon Claw! Oh, he's gonna use Recover now. Oh, that's right. These battles take forever. Oh, uh, cradley, stop. Cradley! That's Miguel, thanks for the $5 it. stream tip. Miguel said, Yeehaw, partner. Yeehaw. Okay. Can I'm gonna try beating an ultimate boss. Yeah, Jerome? Are there actually people in Texas who say yeehaw or no? I mean, yeehaw, brother. Really? I mean, yeah. I never it's... knew. I, I was just curious if that was one of those things where people just like, you know, like stereotyped it or if like it actually was like a thing. No, nah, some people say yeehaw. Some people say howdy. I'm more of a howdy sort of fella. 
Howdy. I like howdy. Howdy, howdy, howdy. Simon Fraser thinks the $7 stream tip. He said, the Pokemon band are Venusaur, Gyarados, Porygon 2. How do they even ban Porygon 2? Wait, why Porygon 2 and not Porygon Z? What makes Porygon 2? <laughs> anyway. If you like. <sighs> oh, okay, fair. Uh, yeah. No Tyranitar, no Tor... What's wrong with Torkoal? No Hippowdon, no Magnezone, no Togekiss, because there's no way to beat them right now. Lame. Miguel Granillo <laughs> thinks the five dollar stream tip. He said, "I say it unironically." You do? So you see, you're a yeehaw? <laughs> yeah, that's about half the list. There's also Excadrill, Whimsicott, Incineroar, Mimikyu, Rillaboom, Cinderace, Indeedee, and Dragapult. So pretty much just these ones are too powerful. Don't use them. <laughs> I think I made this cradley run out of moves. Nice. And by run out of moves, I meant just recover. But still, that's enough. I can finally beat him now. You are trash. <laughs> you are trash. You are rubbish. Garbage. You are garbage gym leader. You should hand over crown to anyone but you. Yes, goodbye. You are garbage, and I will not miss you. I mean, I'll kind of miss him. No. I'll miss beating him. <laughs> <laughs> Proceeds to cough up eight lungs. Specifically eight? Yeah. yeah. Not gonna cough up only three. Okay. I was actually pretty close to beating that, like, ultimate trainer. So let's see if I can beat a legendary trainer. Let's lead with... Drift Bloom. I'm okay. waiting for a trainer to accept my battle of Mortal Kombat and stuff. Okay, so what is that? Is it going to be a Mega Charizard X or Y? You're not going to want to miss this Minecraft video, so make sure you rope. Did we finally get a challenger? Okay, here. Let's go. Okay, they're hitting me with a level 55. We might be able to win this. Okay. That is still a dragon. That is still oh a fire. Oh my goodness, Sugarai Shasaro! Uh, Kyle Penland! Thank you for being the captain of the live stream by a long shot with a $150 stream tip. He said, hey, Cappy, you should pick that Salamence Jerome has at his party right now. It looks nifty. Kyle, no! Luckily no. enough, though, it is a random Pokemon. Cappy doesn't get to pick. So, Selena, you got to get ready to roll the randomizer, but um, you'll have to wait one second because I'm in the middle of a battle and I might break everything. No, we're doing it right now. No, we're... Selena, please. But right now. Kyle, thank you for that $150 stream tip. I really appreciate you, pal. That was... Wow. Thank you so much, man. Thank you. You better get ready, Jerome. Okay, okay. I'm, I'm not done crushing this person yet. No, we're doing it right now. I am pulling up the... <laughs> Do it now. <laughs> Do it now. Kill his entire account. <laughs> Just okay. take all of it while he's in a battle. Ninja Bear, thanks for the $10 stream tip again. He said, Jerome's favorite Pokemon besides Nose Pest, since it's your spirit mon. Mine's Wailord and Whalmer because it's so cute. And Derby. Who's Derby? Is that a Pokemon? Hmm. Uh, he said, anyway, also, Jerome, don't Derby. let Mew down and lose this battle, dude. Oh, He's still hitting us with the puns. And my favorite Pokemon besides Nose Pass or Probo Pass, because they both, you know, they're both my spirit animals. My favorite Pokemon besides those... I'm going to have to go with a Gengar. I love using Gengar in battles. He's so much fun. Oh, yeah. I hate the Dream Eater strat. <laughs> Simon Fraser thinks the $7 stream to said, Last one in Pokemon Go, you doing the po Porygon event? Yeah, absolutely. Porygon event this Sunday, dude. Two days. You think I'd miss that? I'm not missing it for the world. I'm getting a Porygon Z. I'm going to get a shiny Porygon Z out of this. I'm going to get four shiny Porygon Zs out of this. Shell trap. Yeah. Four shiny Porygon Zs, though? That's crazy. I'm going to get five. Dude. 
But yeah, for Where's real, going? Though, I'm going big. Dude, I'm happy for you. I'm not the bi- I'm like not the biggest fan of Pokemon Go. That's fair. It's definitely not for everyone. I just like it because it gives me something to do, and it also gives me points for walking. <laughs> Basically, what I'm saying is I like to get rewarded for existing. <laughs> Are you waiting for uh, Pokemon Sleep? Don't even Ooh. joke, Selena. No, that's an actual thing. What do you mean? What do you mean? Do I get more points for sleeping more? <laughs> Are you serious? They, uh, they announced it like last year. I don't know if they yeah, just got delayed due to uh, stuff happening in the world or something. But it's uh, some, some yeah, a thing similar to Pokemon Go where uh, you get rewarded for having a healthy sleep schedule. What? Yeah, man. It's pretty dope. And it like you, you put your phone, you know, next to your pillow or whatever, and it'll it'll sense, you know, how good of a night's sleep you're getting. This is just so that the Nintendo can get data on us whenever we're dreaming about Pokemon. I mean, one hundred percent. This is a, a data collection scheme. I'm sure. I'm not sure, so don't sue me. But uh, if I had to guess. If I had one best guess, there we go, that's some legalese for you. That would be the guess as to why they were doing it. But anyway, thank you, Rustic Flux, for the $5 stream. They said, would you ever make a Pokemon Go video? I wouldn't do a video on it, but I don't know. I was, I, if I could figure, uh, no, I probably I probably would. Chess, chess Man and GoPro, uh, record with an app on your phone, overlay, boom. I mean, you could do something cool with it. I just don't want to, like, disappoint him because I, I don't see myself doing it. So I don't well, want to, you know. Put do- it on Instagram. Oh, Graham. The Graham. You, like, put it All on right, Instagram because it's vertical team. videos. Hmm. Did you shuffle your team, Jerome? Oh, yeah. Let me shuffle the team here. So thank you again yes. to Kyle Penland for that $150 stream tip. You're the captain. And, of course, for the $150 stream tip, that means that Cappy gets one of my Pokemon at random. So, Selena, let her rip. We randomized the team. Alright, it's number four. No, not my Caesar! <laughs> that was the best Pokemon on my team! <laughs> I could really though. That was the only <laughs> good Pokemon I had. Where did that even go? I will never it's forgive you, Cappy. Can't explosion. Cappy. Wait, can it? Uh it might. No. You don't go okay, well, there. Let's, let's don't find you, out. Don't you oh, hurt my Caesar? Caesar. Don't hurt my oh. Caesar. Oh, Kyle. Why? Thank you again for the hundred fifty dollars stream tip. But Kyle, that was the best. I've been working on that Pokemon for over two weeks now, for this series, for this big nah. tournament. Oh. Oh. <laughs> How could you let him do this, Selena? I didn't let him do anything. I specifically only blame you for this. Yeah, it's definitely Selena's fault. And also, it can't learn explosion, so it's useless. Wait, if you me. want something for explosion, I'll trade you my Fortress for that. Uh, Fortress level 2,591. I... So he's not even like that much lower. <laughs> and he explodes. I don't know. What, what else you got? I got a Gyarados, level 2100, Victini, a Mech Victini, level 70. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah. Can, Victini, can, can Victini learn explosion? Uh, Victini. <laughs> uh, Mech. Victini. Because um... I'm just saying, if it can learn explosion, like. No. Okay, then you your scissor is dead to you. Oh, what about what about um, uh, Mech Salamance? It can learn self destruct. Yeah, but that's just poopy explosion, though. <laughs> <laughs> explosion of poo. Yes, <laughs> it's just poopy explosion, though. It's poopy. It sucks. But nah, man. Uh, you got any shinies? Why don't you open some keys and tell us where you can get those keys? I don't have any keys left. Uh, um, but you can get the keys from the shop. Mean, Jerome, you have um, the, you have keys like right, 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 um, right there. Right, whoa. whoa! All right, three whoa. shinies. All right, here we go, everyone. Wish me luck here. Thanks to those three shinies Selena gave me. If we can get lucky, we need a shiny exploding Pokemon for Cap. 
Come on. I, mean, I didn't give you anything, though. Uh, if it's a cool enough shiny, I may just, like, get Selena to teach it, like, explosion by force. <laughs> okay, that one was uh, a shiny hippopotus. Shiny illumized. None of these can learn it. Come on, please. This is my last one. This is my last shiny crate. Please, please. Shiny Mincino. No, none of them can explode. Okay, tell me which ones they are again. I have, had a, in total, a shiny Stunky, a shiny Lillipup, a shiny Hippopotus, a shiny Illumise, and a shiny Mincino. Give me the shiny Stunky and Selena. Can you make it learn explode so it's a Stunky explosion? <laughs> and then it also can get the ability Aftermath, so it just kind of... Well, Skun Tank might be able to do it, right? Or Stun Tank, whatever he is, Skun Tank. Uh, might be. Thank you, Ninja Bear, for the five dollars stream tip. Ninja Bear said, "Also, tell Cappy his skin reminds me of the show Steven Universe on Cartoon Network. It's a great show." You know, you know, it is. It, I, I just edited a Steven Universe skin. Really? Yeah. St oh. Stunky just straight up learns explosion at level forty-five. Dude, that's that's your jam. Give me that Stunky. Give me that Stunky. I want that Stinky. Give me that Stinky. <laughs> All right, Cap. Yeah. Stink, stunk. I was thinking about it. Da, da, da. <laughs> okay okay so you want your scissor yes okay here you go thank you cappy yes cappy this was very kind of yes mm, i owe you many it? thanks for I'm taking going to... stinky off of my hand <laughs> i will name this one jerome's childhood home no <laughs> Say it that, so. That, nah, that's too long a name, bro. Ninja Bear wants to, you to name it Stinky Steven. Stin yeah, I'm Stinky Steven. Hey, Cappy, what would you do if I uh, renamed my Caesar? To what? Julius. Julius Caesar? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, go for it, bro. That's pretty good. I like that. That's pretty good. Blade's <laughs> gonna get offended. Why? Because you're not naming it Blade. Oh, then you should have a hone edge called a two brute. <laughs> <laughs> I get it. I don't get it. I'm <laughs> Wait, like for real though? No, I got it. I got it. I got it. I don't okay. get it. <laughs> well, I'm not gonna explain I'm kidding, it. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I don't get it. I'm not gonna explain it though. So sucks for you. <laughs> so, I, feel, I feel bad for those that don't get it. <laughs> oh man, could, hey Jerome, I totally got it. But could you explain for everybody who didn't? No. no. <laughs> For for everybody who didn't get it, I I can uh, explain it. Julius Caesar got pokey poked by his friend Brutus, and so don't Hone say Edge it like that is... either. That's worse than what you're trying to avoid. So Hone Edge is a sword, and he stabbed people. Yeah, yeah. We we use the big boy words around here. Question about the origin of the word brute? Did it come from Brutus betraying Caesar? Is uh or or completely unrelated that his name. It basically brute. Uh, I think his like full name is Brutus. Yeah. Yeah, like brute. Brute is like a, uh, like an affectionate name, I guess. I think they were like Biffles, and like, they, like it was bad. Yeah, that's why I was saying. I, I just assumed brute. Okay. The word, like origin-wise, maybe came from Brutus's name. Entomology. A brute. Let's see. Okay. Of or belonging to animals, non human, from the old French brute, coarse, brutal, raw, crude. Y yeah, no, the answer is no. So that guy just had a trash name then. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Wow. Kind of like uh, whenever I was a kid and everybody called me Scout Underwear. Oh, no. Yeah. <laughs> It was better than them calling me Zippity Doodah, though. 
was not a fan of that. And then my family called me Scooter Pooter Rotor Rooter, so I was really just kind of done from the beginning. <laughs> I had a nickname Soupy for a few years. Where did that originate from? I used to How do you go from Jerome to... I used to love so soup. <laughs> Man, soupy. You soup guys, is weird. You guys must not understand New Jersey Italian nicknames. Clearly not. Hey, soup. How you doing, yeah. soup? Hey, What's the, up, soup? Hey, the kid loves eating soup. Why don't you call him soupy? That's hey, how. man, that kid sure walks around. You should call Walkie. I forgot what comedian it was where he was just like, he's like, yeah, he's like when you grew up and, you know, the people around you, if you shared the same name as someone else, then whoever had the name second would just get nicknamed after the worst possible trait about them. <laughs> like stinky. <-ier. laughs> it's like, hi, I'm Bill. Hi, I'm Bill. No, you're stink face. <laughs> And the worst part is it's so true. It's like they don't like, like the nicknames they never pick like the best attribute. You know what I'm saying? It's always the worst possible thing they can think of. Like, ah, well you both can't be named John, so you're uh <laughs> yeah. You're a uh, fingernail man. Yeah. Your fingernails. Your your fingers you're, over there. You're Halo man. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Well, I think on that note, everyone, we're going to end it off here, the stream. But we had a lot of fun. We'll be back live again on Sunday, so don't go too far. But you should go check out some of the videos that have gone live for the last day. Pretty cool stuff. Got more coming at you as well. Have a great weekend, everyone. Catch you at the end of your weekend, Sunday night. Bye. Oh, and thanks for sponsoring.